What is going on ladies and gentlemen, my name is Nikolai Espresso and welcome back to another Black Ops 3 Zombies video here today on the channel. Today we're going to be talking about goes in depth with the actual size and scope of Shadows of Evil. If you don't know already, Shadows of Evil is slated to be the biggest map to date here, especially in Black Ops 3 moving over into it. Yes, it's even rumored to be bigger than Transit, which, take that how you will, I think that with the right fine tuning and different details to it, I think that it could play a lot better than Transit itself. But the biggest Big thing here with that is how are we gonna get around if this actually is the case this map is that big as the rumors say well that answer was actually given to us not too long ago here on the Call of Duty official website it was updated with its own page for zombies to which it gave some insight into the actual shadows of evil world now it starts off with the first of this actually being describing the world set in a fictional 1940s city shadows of evil is a film noir inspired horror story centered around four particular particularly troubled individuals, the femme fatale, the magician, the cop, and the boxer, and spans an entire metropolis swathed in evil. Welcome to Morgue City. Each of four characters awaken to a nightmarish world overrun by the undead. Each character fights to overcome confusion and amnesia in the hope that they will piece together the events that brought them to this twisted world. Then moving along, it describes the actual city that we'll be playing in a little bit here. Morgue City is the ideal backdrop for a noir horror story featuring a theater district, jazz clubs, and a suspension railway. Now the first two we've actually already seen. The theater district can be seen in a few different frames of the trailer, and the jazz club can be seen where the pack-a-punched weapon is actually being fired off. But the suspension railway, that's the big thing here. That's what we have not seen, and something that could play a major part in the actual zombies map itself. If this map is actually as big as the rumors say, a suspension railway to call around and get around the map would be absolutely brilliant. Maybe it wouldn't play out exactly like the busted where it's set on a certain timer, and if you didn't make it, you're kinda screwed and out of luck there, but it's something that could be definitely played upon and definitely be a key feature here in Shadows of Evil. That that being said though, I really think that this could be the way that we're getting around in Shadows of Evil. From just what we've seen so far, the map looks absolutely massive. So if the rumors, like I said, are true, that this map is as big as it's rumored, we're definitely going to need a way around other than just walking and running, simply because there are so many things here in this map that are meant to be found, that are meant to be done, and if we simply can't make it there after a certain round, kind of defeats the purpose of having the map being that big. So in my eyes, I definitely see this happening. Obviously, this is a recent update to the Call of Duty website, and I think this could be our first little tease as to what it actually is. Now, we don't actually see this just yet. There is rumor that we may have actually seen one frame or maybe two in the actual trailer, but right now, there's nothing to really go off of that's set in stone. So until then, we're just stuck theorizing here. So I'd love to hear your thoughts down there in the comment section down below. Do you guys think that the suspension railway system would actually work out pretty nicely here in Shadows of Evil, or do you think that it might be a little bit too much a transit bus 2.0 or whatever you want to call it love to hear your thoughts down there in the comment section down below but that's where we're gonna wrap the video up here today ladies and gentlemen thank you guys so much for watching if you did like the video be sure to like rating down below any shares of your facebook twitter and or myspace if you enjoyed that always greatly appreciated if you're new here be sure to subscribe to the best of quality black ops 3 content any new news information you guys know exactly to find it right here on my channel thank you guys once again so much for watching my name is Nicole Espresso as always hope you guys are having a great day i'll see you guys tomorrow take care and peace